Hello, uh, my today video is uh, regarding uh, large intestine and, uh, and small intestine blood supply, superior mesenteric artery and inferior mesenteric artery. And okay, so let's see. This is uh, large intestine, and uh, I uh, I draw this small intestine so that I can draw uh, the arteries of superior mesenteric artery and inferior mesenteric artery. So first, I have to. Uh, okay, so this is a diaphragm. I can see, we can see. So like, okay, we have to understand first one. This is the diaphragm, and uh, here abdominal aorta comes. Suppose uh, this is a ciliar trunk. So from the ciliar trunk, this is a superior mesenteric artery, superior mesenteric artery, and the left side is inferior mesenteric artery ciliar trunk cili uh, this is abdominal aorta the right side uh, originates superior mesenteric artery and the left side originates inferior mesenteric artery so <clears throat> and so and the one more important thing superior mesenteric artery uh, originates front of lumbar for lumbar one and the inferior mesenteric artery lumbar third this is the so now I will I will explain. So this is a large intestine. Uh, this is a right side of large intestine and and here left side of large intestine. And uh, I draw this small intestine. Suppose this is small intestine. Uh, of course, of small intestine is a full of uh, uh, full of in the in the, this uh, vacant area. Um, but I have to draw superior, I have to draw arteries so that I draw this uh, imaginary line of a small intestine. And <clears throat> half of a small intestine is called jejunum uh, and half of is ileum. And this is the cecum part. So this is a valve of ileocecum and and this is a ascending, ascending uh, column and appendix ascending column and the curve of large intestine called uh, right colic flexor right colic flexor and this is transverse colon and the left side of colon called left colic flexor and descending colon sigmoid colon and the rectum so this is the uh, basic basic information about uh, intestine large intestine and small intestine now I will uh, draw superior mesenteric artery and inferior mesenteric artery. So suppose from uh, there, this is the abdominal aorta, like uh, imaginary line. I can draw and draw from there, like is superior uh, abdominal aorta comes, and uh, abdominal aorta. <coughs> Wait. So from the abdominal aorta, right side, lumbar first. Uh, uh, this is a superior mesenteric artery originates originates superior mesenteric artery uh, first i will draw the arteries then i will be i will uh, i will be naming from the blue color and this is superior mesenteric artery okay so <clears throat> The first branch of superior mesenteric artery is emerges uh, from here. Uh, there are two branches. First, uh, the one branch goes to a transverse colon and one branch goes to the ascending colon. And this artery called medial medial colic artery. And the second one is. And there are many anastomoses, uh, anastomoses between middle colic artery and right colic artery, and there is also one artery, there is also one artery, this is called iliocolic artery, iliocolic artery, this iliocolic artery, right colic artery and middle colic artery, the, they will be, there will be anastomos, and also, Okay, I will talk about. I will talk later about anastomos. Uh, 
Um, but uh, first, uh, we have to uh, see the branches of the superior mesenteric artery. So, and this is also the anostomus. Superior mesenteric artery. First, uh, first branch is middle colic artery. Then second one, right colic artery. Then the third one, iliocolic artery. Why? Because the small intestine ilium part is, and this is a colon. Colic part, so uh, iliocolic artery gives the blood supply to the ileum also and the colon also. So uh, that's why this artery uh, named iliocolic artery. <coughs> and the superior mesenteric artery uh, gives also uh, gives to the small intestine, uh, small intestine also uh, small intest for blood supply to small intestine, uh, jejunum and ileum both. Uh, and one also most important branch is there. This uh, branch is called uh, pancreatico duodenal uh, uh, pancreatico duodenal artery, inferior pan uh, inferior pancreatico duodenal artery. Uh, this branch uh, give uh, blood supply to the pancreas and duodenum. A uh, duodenum is a uh, like this. If I will draw duodenum like this, then like this will be coming. This will be duodenum and the middle in the mid side of duodenum pancreas will be there. So this uh, artery will give uh, blood supply to the pancreas and pancreas and uh, duodenum. That's why this artery name is pancreatico uh, pancreatico uh, duodenal artery and inferior side. Uh, so this is uh, so this is the information uh, about. And there is also one thing, these all branches have uh, marginal arteries. These marginal arteries goes straight to deep, uh, deep in large intestine so that so they can give blood supply. This is the large intestine <coughs> blood supply about, this is about superior mesenteric artery. Now I will draw inferior mesenteric artery. So here inferior mesenteric artery starts. So and this was the lumbar one and this will be lumbar three. So in the first branch of the inferior mesenteric artery name is uh, what was the here? Here was uh, okay, I will draw this. I will write him by green, right colic artery, and on the in inferior mesenteric artery, there is a branch called because this is left side, so left, and this is colon, so left colic artery, and there is also one anostomus between two, between middle colic artery and left colic artery, this anostomus called Riolans anostomus. And I will name it later. So, uh, this is a left colic artery and there is also uh, two, uh, two branches give blood supply to the sigmoid colon. So, these, uh, these, uh, these artery name is uh, sigmoid arteries. They are all marginal branches straight go to go and uh, these all branches are connected with each other. Uh, so and one artery gives blood supply to rectum and uh, yeah. So this is this artery called rectal artery. One more thing, guys. The in the rectum, mainly three arteries give. Uh, one gives superior, uh, another one medial, and uh, uh, one is inferior. So from the inferior mesenteric artery, uh, only uh, only from the inferior mesenteric artery, only superior side gives uh, to the blood supply. Inferior, middle, and inferior side. Uh, blood supply from the another branch another 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 artery so 
that I will discuss in uh, next video or in the next week. So this is the now I will uh, this is the uh, information about uh, now I will name it. So this was the superior mesenteric superior mesenteric artery middle colic artery right uh, right colic artery iliocolic artery guys uh, i also want to uh, discuss one uh, one important point the iliocolic artery give uh, gives uh, two branches three branches actually one branch give to the uh, anterior uh, if i will call anterior colic artery and one posterior colic artery like okay one anterior colic artery and one posterior colic artery and the one uh, more branch that gives blood supply to the appendix and so this artery name is appendicular artery appendicular artery so appendix appendicular so iliocolic artery th uh, three part i here i told uh, one gives anterior part of the cecum and uh, another one artery gives posterior part of the cecum to blood supply and uh, appendicular artery one uh, branch will come to ap appendix that called appendicular artery so and here uh, pancreatic duodenal artery inferior side of course inferior in inferior pan critico duodenal okay uh, just pancreatic it's a big name so pancreatic so pancreatic duodenal artery inferior pan uh, pancreatic duodenal artery gives blood supply to the pancreas and duodenum so this is the information about uh, superior mesenteric artery now i will name it inferior mesenteric artery in oh sorry inferior mesenteric artery and the first one name was left colic artery and these uh, three branches are sigmoidal artery sigmoidal Sigmoidal artery. Sigmoidal artery. And the third one is rectal artery. Superior rectal artery. The name will be superior. Superior rectal artery. Hmm. So this is the information about. Uh, the superior uh, mesenteric artery and inferior mesenteric artery and guys if you like it the video please like and comment thank you subscribe my channel thank you so much guys please